Hey guys, today marks a very special occasion. It's Billy's very last chemo session. Now, we originally were supposed to come in next week, but due to the long weekend, we fast-tracked. There was no traffic. The commute was just perfect. Everything's just lining up amazingly. Right, Billy? Okay, so if you're just catching on now, uh, Billy was diagnosed with lymphoma back in January after a summer full of um, immune system issues. I'm just relieved it's finally over. And of course, we wouldn't have been able to do it without everybody's love and support, uh, the amazing staff at Toronto Central Veterinary Referral Clinic and Dr. Fenora. And of course, Billy's grandma, his mama, who's been amazing and so supportive every step of the way. We're just, um, I'm just so touched by everyone's love and support. So this little guy is getting uh, hot in the car. So without further ado, let's head on in, shall we, Billy? Come on, let's go. You ready? Okay, so Billy's gonna be about half an hour. He's getting his final dosage of doxorubicin. So uh, every cycle has four different medications that he receives. This is the very final one that he normally reacts pretty strongly to. Uh, last time he had it, uh, he vomited pretty profusely and um, wouldn't eat for a few days. So hopefully we're just fine tuning the dosage a little bit more. So hopefully he won't be as sensitive to it this time. But again, uh, just glad that this is the last one we're going through. The staff have been wonderful and I'm just I'm excited for them. Maybe we'll get him some ice cream. Now a common uh, misconception about chemotherapy is that it cures the cancer completely. Now what this does, especially with lymphoma, is that um, it puts Billy into remission. Average could be two to eight months, it could resurface. There's always a possibility of that. But at least as per Dr. Fenora, you know, what's due on my part is I've got to be diligent about checking his lymph nodes regularly. Uh, you know, if anything seems out of the ordinary, there's swelling again. At least I know what to look for and to come back in. I mean, knock on wood, hope this is the very last visit we don't have to come back again. But even if not, we know what to look for. Now, a, another thing that Dr. Fenora tells me is that even if the cancer does return, he might be able to treat Billy at least another two to three more cycles to at least, you know, put the cancer into remission again. So, I mean, him being 15 years old, I mean, I don't, really don't know how much time I have left with him, but, you know, it does put it into perspective. At least I know I have my options. And uh, we take things day by day as they come and just be grateful, you know, for what we have. It's really uncertain what's going to happen next, but, you know, we do what we can for the people we love, right? So one kitty scoop of vanilla for Billy. Here he comes. Oh, baby. Billy, you did it. Good work. Look at that face. Oh, he's so happy. Hey, what's that? 